Welcome to IC3D training video Advanced Shelf Layout Tools. IC3D has a unique way of displaying completed packaging products within a realistic shelving and stacking environment. In the template window, select the shelf template and drag it into the 3D view. Add the model to the scene. A shelf is displayed in the 3D view with three default labels. Select the Add Models icon in the Shelf Layout window. Browse to the IC3 model you wish to add and select Open. While in position, this model can be positioned in order to optimize its display. The Shelf Alignment radio buttons in the Shelf Layout window allow you to position the can to the left of the shelf or to the right of the shelf as desired or the can could be centered. X, Y, and Z item start offset buttons in the shelf layout window allow you to move the offset position of the can. The X buttons move the item left or right along the shelf. The Y buttons move the item up and down along the shelf. The Z buttons move the item backwards or forwards along the shelf. With the model still selected in the Shelf Layout window, configure the Item Options Across Field to 2. In the Interim Spacing field, type in 10 mm. The items re-space. Further interim spacing configurations can be made as desired. Further configuration of the number of items across will space the item to the interim spacing value. Changing the number of items deep in the item options will also space the items to the interim spacing value. The alternate row option functions in the shelf layout window allow movement of the item rows along the shelf. The X field sets the items in alternate rows left to right. The Z field sets the items in alternate rows back to front. Set the number of items to too high in the Item Options field. Check the Rotate Rows by Radio button and change the angle to 90 degrees in the drop-down menu. The top rows rotate to 90 degrees. The angle can be changed to 180 degrees in the drop-down menu. Alternatively, an angle of 270 degrees can be selected and changed as desired. Additional models can be added to the shelf in order to build up a realistic shelf layout. In this case, we are adding a toothpaste product. The additional model can be separately spaced along the shelf using the Item Separation field in the Shelf Layout window Shelf Options. Set the item separation to 20 mm. The second item respaces on the shelf. The item separation can be changed as desired. The second item can also be step and repeated and spaced independently. The item rows can also be rotated independently using the Angle Rotate drop-down menu in the same way as the first item. In this case, the item is rotated 90 degrees. These shelf tools allow the user to create an array of different stacking arrangements for each item being displayed on the shelf independently to each other. This completes the IC3D training video Advanced Shelf Layout Tools.